I was sold this version of the American dream growing up that made me believe that I could do anything if I put, in my, if I put my mind to it. Um, being diagnosed with diabetes made me feel like that wasn't even possible in many ways because it felt like I met roadblock after roadblock in getting my insulin. And I know that people still deal with that every single day, students, uninsured people, people that go to school and work. I have a doctorate and I still struggle to afford my insulin. It doesn't matter who you are. Um, this is a situation that affects so many people, so many different walks of life throughout America, no matter your socioeconomic status. Um, and it's something we have to fight to continue to change. It's just a really scary reality that in the U.S., one in four people um, have experienced like rationing their insulin in order to either prolong it, to either get to the next paycheck. And so we need a $30 uh, $35, if not cheaper. It was really exciting, um, especially to have the Inflation Reduction Act um, hit the um, Medicare population. It's a great first step. Um, it, I, I was really excited to hear about other legislation was possibly being passed. Insulin is not a choice, and so the medication desperately needs to become affordable and accessible to all. And let alone, insulin's not the only medication or supplies that people with insulin-dependent diabetes need. It's just the first step.